we started um, holding on, grabbing the bike racks. You know, there weren't many of us, so I grabbed um, the middle between two different bike racks. And, you know, I, I wasn't under any pretense that I could hold it for very long, but I just wanted to, you know, make sure that we could get more people down and uh, get our CDU units time to, to answer the call. So we started grappling over the bike racks. Um, I felt the bike rack come on top of my head and I was pushed backwards and my foot caught the stair behind me and I, uh, my chin hit the handrail and then I, at that point I had blacked out but my, um, the back of my head clipped the concrete stairs behind me. Uh, and you were knocked unconscious, is that right, Officer Edwards? Yes, ma'am. Democratic Party wants to throw it under the bus. They want to throw it under the bus with statements like that that he's making. They want to throw it under the bus by intimidating, denigrating, and demeaning the Supreme Court of the United States, and ultimately by packing the court so they can turn it into a political football. And Sean, the thing is, without the Supreme Court being an independent arbiter of what the law is, there is no constitution. They want to pack it so they can destroy the court and in so doing, destroy the constitution. That's why I wrote Saving Nine. Saving Nine tells the story of the last time this happened and the fact that we're still paying the price for it. When you look at, for example, just abolishing the Electoral College or packing the courts or statehood for D.C. or getting rid of the filibuster, all these items the Democrats have brought up, brought up um, and your book really does highlight the importance of the Supreme Court, uh, when they do this, the Democrats have always wanted to do things that they can never get done at the ballot box or can never get done uh, 